Hello, ladies and gentlemen. I am Rarquaza. Welcome back to another Quaza, Quaza Contemplates today. Um, we're playing Deadbolt, which is a game that was just released by Hopo, uh, the creator of Risk of Rain, in case you weren't aware. Uh, this is his second game. Um, and this is kind of like a stealth uh, Hotline Miami act Twitch reflexes slash uh, strategy. I don't actually know what genre this is, but it's it's pretty fun. Um, I've had a blast playing what I have of it. I used to, I played this like once back when it was a, a beta where you could play like one one or two levels, um, and then I played a, a few levels on stream as well. Um, we're gonna start a new game here. Another night. All right, so this is the tutorial level. Uh, the object of the game is to kill all the undead. Uh, you can interact with certain things. Oh, we're this, uh, this dapper skeleton in this, like, overcoat. Um, we have a, a left punch, just a quick punch. Uh, we can interact with things, like this knife. We're gonna murder this guy. Um, if we then knock at this door, we can kill this guy. Good. Uh, I'm not. Am I supposed to be able to do this yet? Okay. Um, so one thing that you can do that I'm not supposed to know yet. Uh, if you press E, you can enter vents, including like toilets. Uh, okay. So if we hold down right, we can throw the knife, and then we can shoot that guy in the face. Good. Excellent. You can also, um, other things you can do are shoot like lights out, you can hide behind, um, hide behind cover. Uh, if you get shot once, you're dead. So that's, that's kind of the gimmick here. Um, so let's knock at this door. Headshots on, uh, these basic dudes, if you can get a headshot, those are instant kills. So that's ideal. Uh, our ammo is up here. The further away that you're aiming, Okay, hold on, let's see. Yeah, that allows us to get in here. We'll take this. With our revolver, we will hopefully, like, shoot these guys in the head. And then be able to also shoot that guy in the head. Excellent. See, it's working out already. We'll wait till this guy comes up here. Oh, nice. Excellent. Perfect. Good stuff. Dead simple. After every mission, we get a rank. Five stars. No deaths, I think, is important. And then 100% accuracy is pretty good as well. Uh, we'll press E to continue. Oh, you're finally back. Candle dude. Can't turn on the lights in here. Um, we're going to sit and talk to Calcifer here. The flames roar to life, and a voice speaks out. Another life will return. My candles tell me tales. Undead form and blossom. Find their abode and knock them free from their jails. The flames never spoke in prose. Undead are the easiest to kill when alone. The fire licks and sneers. Undead, zombies included, must be helped towards the afterlife. So there's the plot dump. We're going to accept the next mission here. Uh, hold on. I had this happen before. I need to... You click on mission or something. Oh shit, you know what? I had this happen before where I didn't actually click mission and... Uh, oh no, okay, this is the first mission. That's fine. Um, there are a bunch of achievements too that I was going to click on, but we'll look at those after this. Okay, so... We can knock on the door, make this guy come out here. Good, excellent, perfect. Um, so, what do we have here? This event system goes up there. This other one is to the toilet. Uh, ideally, we'd avoid alerting anyone, right? Which causes uh, oh Jesus! Okay, we've wasted ammo now. Okay, whoo! We're out of ammo. That's okay though, we need to use the rest of this ammo in order to kill these dudes, otherwise we're going to be in a tough position. We might die here. Uh, 
Oh shit, he got me. I missed him. All right, that's okay. Uh, shit. Knock on this door. If we kill him right in there, they might aggro. We might get more aggro than we want necessarily. Um, I think our strategy isn't bad here, though. Good. Yeah, one of you is going to have to open the door, buddies. Maybe both of you, even. All right, and we're out of money, or ammo. Same thing. Time is money, money is power. Power, ammo is power, ammo is money. You know how it goes. Uh, let's turn out the light in here so that we don't... Hey, buddy. Open the door. Yeah, that's right. Oh, he got me! I didn't, I, oh, I'm so mad. Okay. That's that's how this goes. That's all right. So as you can see, there's there's elements of like stealth gameplay. There's elements of strategy. Um, oh, let's get this guy up here first. I want to use all of my revolver ammo before we uh, do anything crazy here. Okay, we'll knock on the door here. He alerted those dudes. Turn off the light in here. And we'll wait till he comes up the door. Nice, headshots. I was almost out of ammo, so that was a little bit scary. I don't know what Calcifer or uh, freaking Lumiere over here is doing, hanging off of the thing. Not quite sure what that's all about. That may be revealed further as story progresses or something. Oh, whoops. Is he gonna walk over here? I'd prefer to just like, absolutely make certain that we get the kill here. I'm actually not sure what this AI is gonna do. doesn't see me. Oh shit! Motherfucker! I meant to hide behind the couch! Oh my god, that makes me so mad. Okay. Definitely meant to hide behind the couch instead of uh, turn on the freaking light there. That's ridiculous. I like how this melee dude just kind of runs past without really caring. Well, I guess I can come back down here. I didn't even think about that. All right. Actually, this is an interesting strategy. This is maybe a better strategy, is take out all these guys first. Turn off all these lights. Get over here. Fuck. Don't unload. Okay, I have two more shots. Just be patient, and then actually shoot the guy. This has been the worst mission that I've ever done. Okay, uh, we've done it though, it's it's done. Maybe uh, Lumiere is there just to watch us do what we're, make sure what we're, we're doing what we're supposed to do. Clocked in, clear the first mission, nice. Okay, terrible accuracy, because I kind of spammed there. Four stars, we gained 10 souls. Uh, souls will be revealed what they do in a minute. All right, the the music is very chill and kind of fits the uh, stuff as well. I'm not sure if he made the music himself or if he had any help. I, I have no clue about who made the music. Um, the undead begin to crop strange powders from below. Incite the flame, eject their brain, and see what it contains. There's a bouncer on the far side of the house. I can kill him to get his weapon. Large zombie bouncers are large zombies with shotguns. Takes a few shots to the head to bring them down. All right. So the game gets harder. There's new, uh, new stuff. Did I not click on mission? Okay. So 
mission. Intel. Powders. Bouncer. Oh, powders. A new drug called Ash. His candles say that it makes you feel like you're alive again. The flames, my employer, want to know more. Okay. <laughs> new mission unlocked. Gotta click on all the dialogue options. New high. Case number two. The zombies are selling some strange drug. Find out what it is. Alright. So there's our bouncer. Sparkles. Um, there's a new weapon, a hammer. There are a ton of, of weapons. Um, okay, I've used my hammer, which makes me very sad, actually. I, I probably don't want to do that. Yeah, I should probably, like, reset, but that's okay. Headshots are bay. We're gonna turn off this light. I wonder if opening this door... You know what, let's knock on this door. He doesn't hear me. Alright. So we need a few headshots in order to bring this bouncer down. Um, which should be fine because he doesn't see me here. And we'll kill all undead. Done. Fucking sawed off shotgun. So good. Uh, oh, dude, the fridge. Alright. Very nice. That was an easy mission. I wonder if I can get out up here. Oh, shit, you totally can! Oh, and you can fall off of heights. That's really cool. I didn't actually know that. Alright, that was an easy one. Five stars. No deaths, I think, is important to that. We have 50 souls now. Flames are to life, and I see visions inside. The fireplace begins to speak. Flesh caskets breathe. Burn the ash. Scatter their teeth. I see two entrances to the house. The left entrance has less zombies, but the right entrance has more weapons. My choice. New gun. I see visions of Sharon, the ferryman. He may be interested in the souls I've collected for our mutual employer. I should see him at the docks before my next mission. Mission unlocked. Sharon lives at the docks. I can exchange souls for weapons before I accept my mission. All right. So here's a thing. This is kind of the you know the point of why we I guess complete missions well. Um, so we have this. There's uh, you can buy new weapons. Right, upgrades. Uh, death and text. High fire rate holds 14 bullets. What is this? So that doubles our um, our capacity. Revenant. High damage but loud. Holds 5 damage. Extremely powerful headshots. Holds 5 bullets. Uh, high capacity fistle. 10 bullets. Silent weapon but lower damage with 5 round, five mag. 9mm uh, SMG. Holds 30 bullets. Inaccurate. Tactical SMG. Silent weapon with laser. Laser. Semi-auto shotgun, suppressed shotgun, and scythe. Long-range slashing weapon can't be thrown. <laughs> that's That sounds like my cup of tea, honestly. That's 200 souls. Um, that's the most out of these. Uh, secondary knife, hammer, 25 mouse gun, two bullets, low power. Blunderbuss, flintlock shotgun, holds one shot. Flashbang, stuns all nearby enemies. I gotta save up for that scythe, you know I do. 200 souls. So, souls can be gained. Uh, you get some for completing the each each thing, but also... Um, oh, whoops, here. That was the pause menu. Uh, let me sit down here. Hold on, let me click on everything again just to make sure I've unlocked it. Uh, no, if you put achievements... Um, earn every achievement, right? Okay. Uh, beat the entire game without dying or quitting. Get a five-star rating on every mission. Clear a stage with only headshot kills. Kill all undead using the toilet. Kill an undead using the toilet. Uh, buy a weapon from him. Melee a bouncer to death. Uh, kill Puff without using the Tommy gun. Clear a stage with only melee weapons. Collect all memory tapes. Clear the boogeyman without being seen. Clear all Zombie King's missions. Kill a vampire in midair. Let the dead... Okay, yeah. So there's different uh, 
different things and you get souls for those. Um, all right, oops. What's the one? Uh, clear a stage with only headshot kills. Get a five star on every mission. Beat the entire game without dying or quitting. That's gonna be an interesting one. Beat the entire game within one hour without quitting. Okay, so let's try, try for that. I don't know how long we've actually been going here, like 15 minutes maybe? I don't think we're gonna get it. But those are things to try for, uh, maybe in other videos, perhaps. Um, and maybe once you've unlocked some stuff. So the right side has more weapons. Let's, uh, let's get this bouncer going. Oh shit, okay, he's killed me. <laughs> Holy shit, bouncers are nasty. We have a revolver here. Uh, let me turn off the light. I have one shot. Do not miss your chance to blow. This opportunity comes once in a lifetime. We'll take the knife. Oh, shit. Okay, I was going to throw it. I was going to stab him. I just stabbed him too few times. Um, so that actually is not a bad strategy, I don't think. We're gonna wait till this guy comes down here. Good. And we switch for the knife. Wait, right, where does this go? Here we go. Stab this dude. This is a little bit interesting. Nice. I dig it. Use what we can when we have, I think. Get a new up, a new gun here. I don't think enemies can shoot through doors. I'm like 90% certain that they will not shoot through doors. At least these dudes. All right, good. Burn all these info things. Wait till these guys come up. And then we'll stab this guy when he comes up. Nice. Good stuff. Okay. Swap for the shotgun. There's only two guys left. Nice. Excellent. Easy. Easy every time. Four stars, yeah, probably. So I think the important things are either you need no deaths or you need 100% accuracy. That's just a guess, but. Claims road to life and you see visions of man named Puff. No moment to flee. He should not be here. A man with a heart cannot live with me. The candles tell that Puff, tell me that Puff keeps an old machine gun in his basement, something he stole from the Tridez. I'm sure it still works. Uh, shadows cast along the wall and the flames show me silhouettes of Puff, Puff's death. This is the first time my employer has given me a specific target and I succumb to the thrill. Mission unlocked. Okay. So, um, in order to... So, Puff, a low-level deal dealer, Puff, might know about their supplier. Kill him. Um. Roland, pick up the phone! So that's Puff. Uh, if we kill him without using the Tommy gun, then we get a thing. I need you to come over here. Yeah, you're gonna have to open the door, buddy. Luckily, these guys aren't patient or smart, for that matter. Um, okay, so... Nice. Good. Hmm, how am I gonna handle this? Oh, 
Okay, I was out of ammo. Shit. Okay, this may be a bad thing. Jesus. There we go. Alright, good work. Oh shit, I tried to go down the door, that did not work. Ah, oh, fuck. Okay, one more try. Let's go in here. Oh, God! Oh, I'm out of ammo! Damn it! Okay. Go a little bit less ham here. Oh, fucking A. Okay, I have to be super accurate with this. We're gonna... Okay. Whew. Holy shit! I've done it. We've done it. Okay. Holy shit! Oh! Okay. The door to Puff was open. Oh my god, that's ridiculous. Okay. God damn it. Motherfucker. Alright. Surely this time. I think I need to re-examine my strategy, actually. Okay, let's let's try dragging these guys down here this time. Now they're all aggroed. <laughs> yeah, that's right, you better be cowering there. Oh no! Oh my god, that was extremely close. Alright. We're gonna turn off this light. How do I get into that vent? Puff is just gonna wait there, isn't he? I have an idea. We're gonna close the door when he's looking away. Yeah, now you're gonna have to deal with it, buddy, aren't you? All right, check, check the drawers. Desk has a filing cabinet. Maybe there's a useful information in there. I pull out the filing cabinet. There are two separate tables. The stuff tab is full of loose papers. More stuff. You pull up in the drawer and inside is a pamphlet and an embossed coin. Basic financing. Puff must have, Puff must have designated, been designated as the accountant of the gang. Useless. A letter outlining Puff's frustration in the gang. Useless. A poorly drawn picture of a naked vampire. Useless. Paper. Labeled important people. There are addresses scribbled across the, scribbled across the top. Five... 31421st and 4th 101 6th under street or street under these must be the addresses of the zombie king's houses useful um, there's the 314 number homestuck swag indistinguishable scribbles useless man I haven't had my Wheaties today obviously I'm having issues like talking and functioning so we got this super fancy pistol that was puffs too bad we can't keep it Oh, it's a 10 millimeter. Okay. Well, there you go. Bigger holes. All right, we gained 10 souls. We actually, okay, beat him without using the Tommy gun. I think we actually need to unlock more weapons before we do that. Flames rode to life with more vigor than usual. My employer is happy with success. Hellhounds from beneath, bred by the undead. Go stop the weeping and gnashing of teeth. Hellhounds are three-headed dogs with an amazing sense of hearing, but they can't open doors. I'll use that to my advantage. All right, so we're going to have to freaking open doors. Right, close doors tactically. 
Uh, the first address leads to a hellhound pound. End it. Oh god, they're really fast. Oh, Jesus Christ. They're really fast. Out of fucking ammo, mate. I'll just walk up behind him and stab him, that's fine. Okay, so. Set off timer in three seconds. Dude, you can do that? What the heck? Big dude's coming. Do we have another dog there? Yeah. Oi. 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 Hide behind cover. Come over here, bitch. How do we deal with you? There aren't any vents up there, are there? Dude, this is gonna suck. I wonder if I set off this timer. Okay, he's gonna come down here. We'll kill him. Pick up the sawn off shotgun. This should allow us to maybe. Oh, fuck! I need maybe throw the knife. I don't know. Dude, I have to hit every shot here. Oh my god! And I didn't have enough ammo. I need to. Maybe you need to get headshots for even the two hits. Oh my god. Okay. Got this. Try and knife everyone we can. We can also throw the knives, and we have two additional knives remaining. Set off the timer in three seconds. Here we go. Oh, fuck. Okay, I was gonna try and get that thing where you, um... Where you kill a bouncer with only melee, but holy shit. Set tape unlocked. Interesting. Yeah, let's just kill this man. Oh, dude, the dog got me! I thought I thought I would be able to get him as he... Oh, my God. The dogs just kind of murder you. Really pretty much made of plastic here. Nice. All right, we need a better strategy for this. This is a tough thing.
Nice. Kill the dog, that's kind of the main thing here. All right, we've almost done it here. Nice, good stuff, okay, successful. Hey, five stars, nice. I'll take it. What are you doing? Listen to cassettes. Zombie at number one. I wake up, cold water, docks again, splinters in my hand, where am I? Roland's here, he helps, he says we leave, he says we don't have to come back to the docks again. He gives me, me a hit, good hit. I feel it in my tongue, in my throat, in my hands, in my feet, in my ears, and I wake up. How much time? Thump into my ear. Music. I look down. There's splinters in my hand. Roland's gone. I die again. I overdose again. I wake up. Hands, feet. Feet wet. Docs again? I'm in living room. I need more ash. Roland? Roland? I hear more music again. I hear yelling. The room fills up with cold water. I splinter and we all overdose again. I wake up. Knocking at the door. Roland? Only ash helps. Ash brings a bit of Jacob back to me. What happened to Jacob? I remember. He died. He overdosed. My tongue feels heavy in my mouth. Talking is hard. Thinking is hard. Did Jacob pay rent? I shift the shotgun in my hand. Standing is hard. Roland. Roland? Roland says we shouldn't smoke the ash. He says we need it. He says we could leave soon. I hear scuttling. I fire my gun and splatter Jacob against the wall. Thought it was the Reaper. I'm sorry, Jacob. Thick smoke fills the room and Jacob's red and yellow and green corpse is gone. Where's Jacob? I want to be Jacob again. Shit, man. That's heavy. Don't do drugs, kids. That's... <laughs> Holy shit. My candle has searched but never returned. The second address is familiar to the fireplace. I'll find what happened to the candle. Uh, the zombies have hung, hung up security cameras. They don't do much, but will scream... If it sees me for too long, I'll avoid them or shoot them down. Candles are the eyes and ears of the flames, always observing and bringing information. Okay, the Lumiere dudes. All right, what do we got? The Bogeyman. The second address leads to a house with a missing candle. Oh. 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 The entire fucking house. I got a challenge for that at least. Dude. We melee a bouncer to death at the very least. Okay, so this is what we need. Shoot that thing. Pick up the hammer. Suppress 9mm, excellent. Oh shit, he saw me. Okay, hold on. Let's try this again. Okay, that's gonna go down there. Let's let's shoot it. Nice, excellent. No problem, easy. Got that pinpoint accuracy. Okay, come here. Nice, good stuff. Come down here. Okay, the candle dudes don't light up. Inspect candle. 
Doesn't look well. The candle is clutching a note. Cold. Where are you? Go 123, 1023, 8 Northeast Highway Avenue. Thanks. Rip that guy. that's how you kill someone on the toilet man maybe I should have done that here <laughs> could have killed that bouncer maybe um, but we did what we came for him no well no we died that's not true but we did it two deaths not bad what is this lamp turn on Nice. The flames roar to life. The zombie kings have become scared of my hunt. They have become begun heavily guarding a nearby motel. I will find what they are hiding. The candles tell me that zombie kings patrols are nearby. I'll have to be quick in case there are reinforcements. Whoa, the fire's getting bigger. What the heck? No vacancy. Find the location of Roland's warehouse. We will do this. Have you heard about Reaper? Oh, that guy doesn't have a head. He's twitchy. Gurgle. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Alright, we have the hammer. Oh, I see. Their heads are right there. Oh, okay. Oh, and you can either kill the head or their body, maybe. That makes sense, I guess. Okay, so that would be right in their sight range, right there. So we want to... Probably, like, go over here. Actually, here, let's do this. Let's go up here first, because we can guarantee... Oh, shit! Okay. He turned around. I didn't think he would do that. Oh, he probably heard the gunshot, actually. That makes sense. Let's try this. Let's pick up the revolver. Leave the shotgun. We're going to use the revolver. There we go. Excellent. Turn off the light in here. Holy shit. Okay, I did not believe that we were alive there. Oh, I didn't believe that we were alive there either. Oh my god. Hmm. Okay, he's looking that way. Oh shit. Okay. I did not think that he would, um... Allow me to die there. That's okay though. Let's go up here. Kill that guy. We come in here. We're gonna grab the revolver.
Okay, good. There we go. Let's go in here. Turn off these fucking lights. Uh... Hammer that guy. Good. What are we going to do? Open the door, fire two shotgun blasts. Hopefully that head is connected to that zombie. Oh, fuck! Fire two shotgun blasts. Close the door, maybe. Jesus Christ. Already <laughs> the full clip into that guy. It's ridiculous. Now everybody's looking over there. That's actually not a bad strat. Nice. Nice, good stuff. Okay, this is working out. We're gonna go up behind this dude. Let's go. Nice. Okay. We did it. Oh, reinforcements have arrived. Nice. We did it. Let's check the, their car, maybe? Find information. Oh, shit. Oh, dude, this lockpicking style. This is the most fun I've had in a lockpicking minigame. Oh, shit. Stage cleared. Dude, that's the most fun! I like these lights. Get out of here. At least they don't like ding my car. Freaking, <laughs> that'd be so bad. You'd think they'd at least like key their car, key the car as they come past or something. Four stars, not bad. 120 souls. We're almost at that scythe. I'm a patient guy. Flames root of life. I see visions inside. Their location explained. Burn the ash. Burn the dead. And free the souls contained. My mission is to destroy all the ash, but it is best if I keep focused on killing the undead first. Oh shit, supply and demand. Destroy the warehouse where the zombie kings store their drugs. That looks like a... Uh, you need more men protecting the ash, the vampires, man. Bring your own... So he's going to bring in reinforcements, maybe? Okay, we're going to wait in here. Dude, okay.
I don't know <laughs> these. Nice. Okay. Freaking, I didn't see that guy. God, there's a lot of them. Damn it. Okay, hold on. My main problem right now is that I don't have a weapon at all. I think I can make it out of here. What, what's my current swap? Oh shit, we might need to kill these guys. Oh no! Okay. Well, I didn't handle that super well at the beginning. baby okay then we'll do this again so let's go back up here and we'll drop down from above Nice. Okay, and now we've saved our ammo and we can like use this 10 millimeter pistol pretty freely. Burn all this shit. Knock, knock, bitch. How do I turn off the lights in here? I'm assuming vampires must be able to see in the dark on, on some level. this I think that's the way to do it we shoot the heads nice Nice. Return to the car. Pretty good. Look at all these blood spatters everywhere. It's so good. Four stars, not bad. The flames roar to life and I see blood inside. Attempting to lead his greed to salvation, a man with ambition cannot live with me. Roland, his death will shatter the zombie king's leadership. I must remember that the mission is to kill Roland, not the others. Roland's house is filled with many guards, but the only target is Roland. I'll separate him from his men. Okay. Dude, the fire is agitated. Holy shit. Alright, Roland, leader of zombie king, the zombie kings. We've got guns on every floor, Reaper. Go home. All right. I'll do that. Let's see what we got over here. I 
can't come up here. Wonder if I can. No, you can't drop off the top either. Damn it. Oh, fuck. God damn it. Okay, good start. Oh, shit. What is this? Sledgehammer. Now we're talking. Okay. Okay. That's what I'm talking about. Damn it. That's <laughs> just fuck. Sledgehammer. Damn it! Okay, too much melee, not enough sledgehammer. Sledgehammer. Slower. Damn it! Okay, well, how did I do that the first time so easily? Maybe I'll just shoot him in the head. Freaking melee dudes. So what's going on here? Shotgun blast to the face, yeah. Okay, we have a hammer and a sledgehammer. Where does this go? That would drop me off with guns, but without... There's two guys flanking him. Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, what do I do? Oh my god. Okay. Come on, Roland. We've done it. Hell yeah. Cassette tape unlocked, bitch. We're done. We did it. Oh, <laughs> I'll take it. Let's go. Clear all Zombie King's missions. We did it. Achievement unlocked. Woo, three stars. I don't care. <laughs> oh, my God. All right. I think I'll end the video there. Thank you guys for watching. Actually, well, hold on. We'll end it in after we look at our next mission. Um, but I will be doing this uh, on YouTube, but you should definitely buy this game. Uh, support Hopo, the developer. Uh, the Steam link will be in the description. I think it's like $10, maybe $15. $10, I think, though. I want to say $10. Wait a second. I can, I, I'm so professional. It's definitely $10. Yes, guaranteed $10. It might be on sale. Uh, maybe, but you should definitely buy it to support the developer. Pale moonlight, touch, no heat, vampires flock, find out why. Dancing vampires won't notice your presence unless you shoot them. Okay. Tall undead, said to be formed, vampires, t said to be formed by betrayal from a lover. They are much more dangerous than zombies. I'll have to make sure that every shot counts. Look upon your reflection, said the fireplace, and remember that you are different. You are not undead. I'm the reaper. Alright. 
So here's our second mission tree, I guess. I don't know how many mission trees there are, but uh, anyway, we'll try this one next time. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you next time. Hit the like button, subscribe, and uh, take it easy. Bye-bye.